Hi everyone, this is Mike89. Welcome to the 12th video in my Sonic 3 and Knuckles speedrun tutorial series. Uh, this video is going to cover Sky Sanctuary. Let's get into it. Uh, first, but I'm charging a spin dash now. Um, when when you get over to the right hand side of the screen, even though you can't actually see the vine, it's close enough that it starts moving um, because it's on the camera timer. So what we're going to do, we're going to wait until we see Knuckles move here. As soon as he jumps away, then release the spin dash. And now, now that we've hit the right edge of the screen, the, the vine, which is somewhere over here still, uh, has started moving. And it means that when you get full control here, you can charge a spin dash and release it, and the vine here is right at the bottom, perfectly in Sonic's jump range, and it's also now moving up as well, or it's going to be moving up when you need it to be. So, all you got to do is now run into the side of these spikes, as soon as you hit the side, you jump, you jump off again. Now, okay, here the ground is flat, you can see that as you get to the end there, it it dips. So you want to jump from somewhere behind this this pillar around here. Jump insta shield that lightning shield there. So now we have a lightning shield, which is actually essential for this next bit. Now you don't have to face left here, but I recommend it because what's gonna happen here if you hit A too early is you're gonna spin Nash. Uh, now obviously we don't want that to happen anyway. But if you're facing right, this is a death pit at the moment. It's not going to be once we've done this trick. I don't know why, but it just works that way. So we're get, as in, say, flying battery, we're going to hold the screen all the way down, and then switch to pressing, switch to holding right, and jump. Which you'll see if we advance the frames. See that I stand up. And now I'm holding right, and then a few frames later I'll jump. So I go off the top of the screen, and this, like the screen wrap, but not entirely exactly the same, it confuses the game and it thinks you're up the top of the stage. So as soon as Sonic now falls, you see him back on the screen here, and he's about halfway down, you do a lightning jump, and that should get you over to this platform here. Falling anywhere to the left of that is death, which is why you need the lightning shield here. Uh, then we're going to stop and spin dash. So we're right up the top, right near the end. Uh, this is a bit tricky. Jump onto, you can see there's only a very small space here that you can jump onto. And what we're going to do next is do a one tap spin dash and then very quickly jump. So the jump goes out here and then we're going to lightning jump up to the top. Which you can see here. Oh, you just got enough height to do that. Now, Metal Sonic is home to the only randomness in the game. Uh, whether he stays still on one side of the platform or zips back over to the other side is actually random. But by taking a hit here, you can actually it actually doesn't matter which way he goes. So the reason I'm taking a hit is what I want to do now is I want to get a hit on the absolute first frame possible with an insta shield. Here, like that. So if he turns around like this, then he's going to stay in place. If he doesn't turn around at all, he's going to crouch and then zip back to the other side. Uh, if he stays in place like this, you can just sneak in five hits before he curls back up again. And if he zips over to the left hand side you've got a slight chance of sneaking in six either way the fight should take two rounds so let's see here, I'm gonna get five hits before he curls up now I want to take another hit so I'm gonna spin Nash and try and intercept him as he comes in this way so that I get hit to the left like so and then I get the last three hits. Uh, it's the same if he goes to 
the left in the second round are obviously in reverse directions. You want to be moving right as it moves right. Uh, so that's Sky Sanctuary from a speedrun perspective. Uh, let's go back to the start and show you that so you don't get any interruptions.